Hello, I'm Dr. Stuart. I've been asked to talk to you today about why I think that physics is amazing. Now, I'm pretty biased because I personally think that physics is the most interesting and important subject ever. And now, I think that, I think it's important because physics shows us a set of rules that govern nature and using these rules we can understand what's happening around us. It allows us to, to really think and answer some weird and wacky questions like why is the sky blue? Why do apples fall down? Do atoms actually touch? And the rules that we learn about in physics allow us to answer these questions in quite a lot of detail. Okay, and I think that's why I really like physics. It's, the, it's solving problems. It's figuring out the answers to, to questions. And that little spark of understanding when I learn something new about how the world works, I get a lot of enjoyment from. I love it. Absolutely. I think it's brilliant. I don't think there's anything quite as good as it. It's fantastic. Now, it's also important. It's important for our future. Your generation is going to have to deal with some absolutely huge, gargantuan problems Okay, the world is facing a huge environmental crisis with global warming. All the ecosystems around the planet are changing due to the impact of people. Now, your generation is going to have, you're going to have to come up with some solutions, and a lot of them are going to come from physics. How we can develop cleaner sources of energy, new efficient batteries. Okay, how we can transmit energy long distances without losing lots of it. Okay, all these things will help contribute to keeping the world healthy. And by learning physics, by studying physics, you'll have the opportunity to help solve these problems. Now, short term, you're focused on choosing whether you want to go down the combined science route or the triple science route. Now, the two paths okay, will both allow you to access A-level courses in physics. Okay, the big difference between the triple physics qualification and the combined physics qualification is the amount of content. If you choose to study the triple content, you'll get to learn more about physics. You'll get to learn more. Okay, they're both equally tough. Okay, you just get extra time to learn more detail. So, for instance, if you choose the triple option, you'll get to study one of the uh, most popular areas of physics, which is about space where you learn about the origins of the universe, talking about the Big Bang, where we learn about how stars form and how they can explode and leave behind black holes. Okay, and you don't get to learn that content in the combined side. Okay, now, the other important reason why you might be thinking about all these options is your career. Now, there's obvious careers to be gained from studying physics. You can go into research. You can learn science research, which is what I did before I became a teacher. Um, but it also opens huge doors into lots and lots of other careers because of the massive importance in solving problems. OK, so if you were go to study, uh, go on to study physics further. OK, so for A-levels in university, maybe opens doors into things like finance, into computer programming, into economics, and you can earn big bucks, lots of money. OK, it's a well regarded qualification. Universities look on it with a lot of enthusiasm so it allows you to to have more options when it comes to choosing your courses and universities okay and because of that respect employers for all manner of different jobs also value it because of that problem solving aspect every job you will ever do you will need to solve problems and by showing your ability in problem solving by doing physics you can show that you could be able to meet those problems in whatever job you choose, whatever career you're going to go down. OK, um, I hope that was informative. Um, I'm always around if you want to ask questions about what the course is going to be like, or I always love hearing your ideas and your questions about how about how the world works and any interesting physics that you've heard or read about. OK, um, but I wish you well and good luck with your choice.